Welcome to the boat yard. Gonna be a tight squeeze. I got lines over here. I got lines. You'll clear it. You're good. You got plenty of space. <laughs> Hold on. 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 When we return, our new Genoa Sun Odyssey 440 arrived in April of 2021. Watch as we outfit and upgrade Cavu, learn to sail first on the Texas coast, but eventually the world. You can get a light pressure wash and uh, get the zincs replaced. Then we're gonna give uh, Cavu some love. Nah, as you can see. Let's see better this one. It's a design flaw. <laughs> All right. These uh, AC outflows are pounding down, taking this stripe off and also making this terrible stain here and it's really hard to come off so I'm having to scrub it by hand so these are the these are the screws that hold the prop on and that's a hole for this ammo okay so this is the before this is the one we had on before and this is the one that's going on Look at the difference. Yeah, that's why you gotta change them. Yes, very important. <laughs> He's doing his job, Sacri uh -huh. sacrificial animal. Got new ones on the prop shaft, got the prop shaft all cleaned up. Yeah, no. All right, here is Patricia washing the keel. It's scary being under here. You know, my life is depending on these to uh, hold the boat up. No, the keel's holding it up. No, those are holding it up. No, it's resting on the ground. Don't you think the keel will snap off? No. But supposedly these keels just snap off. No, well, this one's not snapping. <laughs> um, so Dave thought we didn't need to clean the bottom. Um, the sponges are telling me otherwise. Yeah, that's pretty nasty. Yeah, the black paint really covers things up. There's Dave scrubbing the boat. Interesting stuff, right? Yeah. Real interesting. <laughs> boat chores.
up here cleaning the windows with this Imar protective polish. Good stuff. We used it on the eyes and glass. I've been very happy with the results. So use this. Got to have a microfiber towel. Put about a quarter size on there. And then do circular motions. Back over here. Smear it around. a little bit more. This is a pretty big window we have here. Alright. Let's get this black area really good. Black spots are dope worse i think it's definitely where the little water spots show up the most all right take a clean microfiber towel and just buff over the window again so this is the uh, rio's garage three in one ceramic formula we washed and did a very light compound on the boat and all this has to do is just mist it on wipe it in and then it's a buff off Super slick. Yeah, I think this is going to be good. Clean the boat does have its advantages. Hey. <laughs> You're shaking your butt a little bit, babe. <laughs> I'm putting some force into it. I know. But I'm enjoying the wiggle. Scrubbing the bottom, it was um, more of a project than I thought, but we have this interesting thing going on with our rudders. Um, so the boat splashed down in April, and there's a bunch of paint coming off the rudders, especially. Um, a little bit off the bottom but this is bad and they didn't even pressure wash this the guy started pressure washing up there and we stopped them because we noticed that the paint was coming off but uh yeah he didn't even touch back here this is just from like scrubbing off the green stuff that was flaking off so we're gonna see if uh maybe it's a warranty item or if not, I don't know. We're de definitely going to have to address this the next time we uh, take Cabo out of water. We're not sure if they'll get to it this time. But anyways, this should be the last day we're up and doing work in the boat yard. Now, when we first got Cabo... This thing you could touch like that and it would close like very easy. And now it's like I got to put some force into it. So. And it was covered with barnacles. And uh, there's all the barnacle bits down there. One of the boatyard guys that cleaned off a lot of them. But there's still some more that I'm trying to get off. Well, that was a long weekend. <laughs> um, first, we washed Cavu. Then we compounded. Then we waxed. And I uh, cleaned the bottom. 
uh, changed out some zincs, uh, repaired some of the tape and gel coat issues we had going on because we had a little help from some friends. But yeah, it came out pretty darn good. Don't forget about the prop you polished. Oh, either. the prop. It almost looks new. Yeah. So this, the only place we really had any barnacles was down here on the prop and prop shaft. Patricia polished this all up and it's looking very nice. We got new zincs there, new zinc there. Uh, if you want to see what our zinc looked like, it was uh, <coughs> pretty eat up. Yeah. Yeah, there's a comparison <laughs> for you. <laughs> That's scary. But one of the problems we have with this, you know, this is our air conditioner return, water return, and uh, it just stains this. It actually had had bubbled up the gel coat here, and that had that was a warranty repair. And then the same up here, uh, it was taking the stripe off and had stained the gel coat through there. That's all nice and clean that now. As good as new. And you can just see the shine that we got on it. Patricia put two coats of glass polish. Oh yeah, I forgot about the windows. On all the glass down mm -hmm. here. And uh, we got the, the bottom all cleaned up for the most part. We got three coats of wax on her, and she'll be ready to get back in the water when the guys come back. So, it's been a long weekend. There was some arguing. <laughs> <laughs> there were some tears. There was aching bodies. Yeah, we two nights in the hot tub, and a couple of bottles of wine, and we made it through it. Yeah, I don't feel too bad today. Yeah, so she looks good. Trisha wants to start on the top side next weekend. Yeah, I'm I'm uh, eager to get it all done, looking uh, good. After we see what this looks like, uh, I say I, I really want it. I mean, this is better than what it was delivered to I, us. I, I think so too. The uh, the service manager was here, and uh, he just loves that we're taking care of the boat. And uh, he said that you know they used to do this. We only need some money thing, and uh, but compounding the boat and waxing it uh, just really, I mean, it's a showroom shine right now. All right, make sure you uh, like and subscribe, it really helps us out. And join us next time as we start on the top side of the boat and maybe get in a quick local sale. <laughs>